Good morning. Today is February 29th, 2015. My name is Amanda DeFeria, and welcome to another edition of the Comedy and Cover Kids Weekend Edition News. James. Good morning. I'm James. So what have been a few minutes, Amanda? Thank you, James. This morning's hot topic will be on homework. We... We here at the Comedy and Cover Kids do not see the need for so much homework to go home every night with us kids. I mean, we work very hard at every school day for six or more hours a day. By the time we get home, we are tired and we need some time just to be kids. Let, let's ask my, my co-anchor what his opinion is on this. James, what do you feel about this? It's not good. Thank you, James. See everyone, kids need to be free. A recent poll I a recent poll I took of some fifth, fourth, third, and second graders all felt upset when when they had to do homework. All felt they all felt like they did not learn anything new. In fact, an article by Psychology Today states that no research has ever has ever found that there is a benefit to assigning homework. They state that people are misinformed about what the evidence says. I think teachers are just giving it because because they want to. We are there are articles and sites supporting the same thing. Doing homework does not help kids get any smarter. In in this reporter's opinion, kids should do what that they have to do at school. The, and 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 get a break from homework. I feel that we should be free when we are home. We we will come in rested and happier because we know when the school day ends, we can go home and just be kids again. So I am asking teachers all over consider giving no homework or at least just let us have a couple few days off. James, and now for the weather. James, they gonna be sunny again. In the, in the mall, it's going to be cold. Travel may be dangerous, so if you can stay home, do so. Thank you, James. And now for a new segment we call Toy Talk with Michael. My brother Michael will be reviewing a toy every week. Michael. Thank you, Amanda. And today's toy review is about this five pop and pop show. It ripped a little. I'm so sorry. So let's get it open. We have, and here's all the puffs we got here. First up, we have Chip. He's a movable head. No moving or anything, just his head. And he's laying down, I think, for puff food, maybe. Next, we have Rubble. He's a dicker and he looks all normal. Maybe he's ready for a pop, pop. Thing. I mean the food thing. Yeah. Next we have Sky. She flies in the sky and she's ready to fly. Next we have Rocky. She he always wants to pick up garbage and he doesn't like water. So here's Rocky and I guess he's walking to the recycling. Next we have Marshall. I think he's like Chase because. It's for pop food too. And we have Zuma holding the dog bone and he's all kind of I don't even know what he's for, so So there's all the five pups I can't stand about. So Thank you. This has been Toy Real with Michael. Amanda Thank you, Michael. And now for sports. In today's NBA news. James is still showing fans and teams alike that he's still one of the best players. James's, James led the Calviers to a home win against the West beat, beat, best beating in the, the Warriors 110-99. to 99. James had a high season of 42 points and 11 rebounds with 5 assists. He had 38 points at the end of the third quarter. Keep up the great work, LeBron. And now for the recipe of the day. It, it is raspberry cream cupcakes. It is amazing. I personally love it. And 
Everybody loves it because it's amazing. It's just, there's cr raspberry cream in the middle, raspberry cream on top with, with like all these beautiful raspberry, fresh raspberries on top. It's amazing tasting. Where you can find it, all you have to do is I'll go online and type in raspberry cream cupcakes. It's the first one that shows up. It is amazing. Okay, now James tried this and what did you think of it, James? It delicious. <laughs> Thank you, James. A good idea to do with the kids is make paper airplanes and have a contest to see which one flies the farthest. I have a kit with air I have a kit I have a kit right here to make paper airplanes. But you can use regular paper. Have the kids decorate it and fly it away. I'll show you a completed one with Michael and James with Michael and Michael and James will demonstrate. There is boy and girl kits. I have a girl kit and they have two boys kits. Okay, the planes are done and we set up the finish line to see what which planes land first. Michael, James, go! Okay, there you go. The kids will have a great time making and flying the planes. The, James, oh, come uh, on. Okay, there you go. The kids will have a great time making and flying the planes. James got 300. And Michael and Michael got 200 points. This is awesome! If you haven't taken the kids to see this SpongeBob movie, Sponge Out of Water, do so. I personally saw saw this movie and it was fantastic. It had comedy that both kids and adults love. So go see that movie. James, what did you think of the movie? I love it. That's awesome. I loved it too. Thank you for listening, and this has been another edition of the Comedy and Cover Kids Weekend Edition News. Have a good week. See you next week. See you next week. Bye. I thought that my guy. Me too. See you next week. Thank you for listening. Bye. 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 Dun, 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 dun.